Are you planning a kitchen renovation and need some ideas? In this video we are going to share with you no less than 13 different kitchen renovations complete with before and after pictures. After you go through this video your mind will be full of inspiration for your own kitchen renovation. Plus this video is full of ideas you can swipe and deploy for your own kitchen. I am going to let you into a little secret. I am obsessed with cookery shows, second only to my love of home renovation programs. It turns out I am not alone. And this surge of interest is fueling a kitchen renovation everywhere we look. You've heard it said, kitchens and bathrooms sell houses. Renovating your cooking space is no longer an indulgence, but a worthwhile investment in the value of your home. Look no further for that all important inspiration for your kitchen renovation remodel project. Here are 13 of our favourite easy to copy kitchen renovation and remodels that would look good in any home. Number 1 is the flat pack vintage. The major changes to this kitchen apart from a good scrub up are the addition of more bench tops and a small island unit. Having the space to spread out when you cook can feel quite luxurious, but it is also important to make sure you have enough space to move around and open cupboards and drawers. The clean crisp white cabinets are simple IKEA flat pack products. The new bench tops are from IKEA too, though they have stained them dark to add a touch more glamour. For me though the standout addition is the reclaimed vintage chandelier. Adding a central feature like this really draws the eye up towards the ceiling and has the effect of making the whole space feel bigger. Number 2 is Timber Turnaround. The amount of stained pine cabinetry on the show here was the kitchen equivalent of the double denim. In contrast to many of the other projects in this list, this kitchen actually had ample sunlight accessing it, allowing the owners to opt for a sleek dark colour scheme. Again they have added an island unit to increase that element of social interaction in the kitchen. They have also greatly reduced the amount of wall cabinetry, opting instead for full height cupboards and appliances built into the wall. This can be a great way to reduce the amount of visual clutter in a kitchen, making it feel minimal and modern. Number 3 is the mean lean and green. These photos show what a dramatic difference removing visual barriers can make with a kitchen renovation. The kitchen itself is no bigger but by opening it up so that it feels part of the adjacent space it feels much more spacious. This connection is further reinforced by the continuous timber flooring between the two spaces. This project was a complete DIY build and a great job they did too. The brass pendant light fittings and unique wall tiles add a touch of class. They have also opted to splash out on marble bench tops in the revamped kitchen. There are some things that are worth spending a bit more money on and kitchen bench tops are one of them. Stone, marble and stainless steel are all great options for worktops. Number 4 Opening the Avocado and This is another great kitchen transformation making the most of inexpensive IKEA cabinetry. This is really quite a small kitchen and as an enclosed space it is dark and cramped, does that sound familiar? Opening it up to the adjacent living space has had a dramatic effect and the shelving to the rear of the island unit adds some much needed declutter. They have also wisely kept the appliances in pretty much the same place as the original layout. Sometimes this is just not an option but if you can, not moving the plumbing or gas connections too far can really help save on labour costs of your kitchen renovation. Number 5 From Darkness to Light this example just goes to show what a difference colours and finishes can make to the feel of a space with a kitchen renovation. Very little has changed but the transformation is pretty dramatic. The dark timber cabinets were solidly built, often the case with older kitchens, and a lick of paint has brought them back to life. If the cabinets themselves are ok but you don't like the style, a good option is to simply replace the doors with something new. I also really like the DIY concrete bench top they have created for this kitchen. Number 6 is a pattern language. I like this kitchen renovation, I just can't understand why they got rid of that wallpaper. This is just another great example of how a lick of paint can go a very long way. Painting the dark timber cabinets and replacing the pull handles make this look like a completely new kitchen. They have hardly even changed the layout. Putting the money you've saved by painting the existing cabinets into getting good quality bench top and decent lighting is always a good idea and something that easily brings you a return on your investment. I also like how the pendant lighting over the island unit doubles as a convenient space to hang pots and pans. Number 7 is Budget Bling. This is another DIY IKEA special. This kitchen looks a lot more expensive than what it costs in reality. They have managed to fit extra bench space into the window alcove which I think is a really smart move and the poured concrete bench tops make for a really interesting and cheap alternative to stone. This project also makes extensive use of strategic lighting. 
Putting light where you need it, such as underneath the cabinets or over the island unit, is a great way to avoid unwanted shadows or glare when you are trying to cook. Number 8. Turn up the volume. Ugh, this kitchen was so dark and ugly. Have a look at the far stone wallpaper. The 1970s was really an interesting time for kitchen design. Another seemingly dark and cramped space, but this time the owners have cleverly extended upwards. Removing the false ceiling to increase the volume of space while actually reducing the size of the kitchen to some extent makes it feel so much more spacious, light filled and airy. Number 9. Galley Greatness this is a pretty classic example of the kind of kitchen we often find in terraced houses, long and narrow. Again they have cleverly opted not to move the services too far and have connected with the adjacent living space by opening up the joinery and installing continuous timber flooring. They have also added additional bench space with the new island and thankfully have plastered over that hideous feature ceiling. Number 10. A very retro remodel. This is a slightly weird one. Where all of the other examples in this list are bringing old, dated kitchens into the 21st century, this one actually goes back in time to the 50s. Whatever you think of it, there is actually some good attention to detail, from the minty green cabinets to the American diner bar stools. I do like the glass fronted wall cabinets, they make a feature of the contents rather than hiding everything away, and reduce that blockiness you get with the masses of high level cupboards. Number 11. A kitchen with a view. The funny thing about this kitchen renovation is that the first thing that catches your eye is the window and how it is framed. The before state of the kitchen is very outdated, with ghastly colours, but the fact the kitchen cupboards frame around the window is what really makes this kitchen an eyesore. However, what a kitchen renovation, eh? The horrible cupboards have been removed and the window now stands alone giving the kitchen a real focal point. This really does look like a professional kitchen, doesn't it? The colour scheme works great with the wall colour too. 10 out of 10 marks for this one. Number 12. Amazing what a lick of paint can do. There's not been much done with this kitchen renovation except a clever colour scheme and a lick of paint. Terraced houses that haven't been extended suffer from narrow kitchens that can be dark unpleasant places to be in. However, as the kitchen renovation above demonstrates, a good use of colour can really liven up the place. The wooden worktops look great too. Number 13. Knock that wall down. This one is from the south coast of England. The original kitchen really shows its wear and tear and didn't make a good use of space. It's kind of squashed up against the wall with the entrance door right across from it. However, once you remove that wall with the door, it opens up the space and makes the whole kitchen a lot more usable. Couple that with the new sleek modern appliances and cupboards and you've got yourself one nice kitchen. The finishes here aren't overly expensive, most of the money would have went on the remodeling work and removing the wall. So thanks for checking out our kitchen renovations idea video. For a lot more info like this please visit bespokehomedesign.com or click on some of the links below. Also, do you want to know how much your renovation will cost? The most common question we get on Bespoke Home Design and from our clients is how do I get a ballpark figure for my building work so I have an idea of how much it will cost before I start? And there really hasn't been an easy answer to that until now. Well if the question above also applies to you then you need to check out our free Ultimate Renovation and Remodeling Costing Toolkit. Basically we've tried every costing tool both offline and online and we've put together this toolkit which shows you how to use what we consider the best three free online costing tools that exist for the UK market. We break down each one and give you step by step instructions on how to use them and you'll be shocked with how ridiculously easy to use they are. We'll also show you what info you need to fill them out and how to get this info if you don't have it. Again, it's really simple to do. This is the best resource on the big bad interwebs for getting a pretty good ballpark figure for your renovation. And the best part is that you can do it all online. There's no calling anyone or booking an appointment or being hounded by salespeople. In summary, you'll discover the three free and super simple online costing tools made for renovations and remodeling projects. You'll get an accurate cost for your potential renovation in 5 minutes or less, yes it's really that fast. And you'll be able to make sure you don't get overpriced and ripped off by builders on your dream renovation. So to go and get your free copy, all you have to do is click the link below and you'll be brought to a page of the Bespoke Home Design website. And you simply enter name and email address and we'll email you your free copy. So click the link below and get yours now.